Hey there guys, so you are most probably wondering why I'm uploading course content onto a short form video platform like TikTok. Reason being is because I want to get in early, knowing that the algorithm may change over time or is already changing uh, to be more like YouTube's algorithm. So I believe that they want to retain their current short form creators and the current um, user base and then integrate them with more long form content and uh, be more like YouTube in some ways. So they're taking a bit from YouTube and then their current platform and combining and bringing it together, which I think would show a lot of promise. I do, however, disagree with some things like they are a bit strict with the restrictions and the bans um, in some demographics it's okay people are used to it in others however people aren't used to it and I, I just think in some ways that that might scare some content creators from like ever joining the platform but other than that, the platform is great. I mean, they're doing a fantastic job, even with the restrictions and still, still, they are still able to retain the user and creator base, which is fantastic. So yeah, overall, I, I think they're doing a wonderful job. So yeah, um, yeah so I'm uploading course content I'm cropping some of the clips and speeding up some of the clips in order to fit it into the 10 minute window time frame so that it could be uploaded onto the TikTok platform and yeah so I started with the Java fundamentals now I've just uploaded a few videos on javascript fundamentals and then uh, thereafter i'll upload html and css fundamentals and then get and get up and then later on i'll add, uh, upload uh, advanced javascript so yeah i want to get in early that's why i'm uploading this course content onto the platform and yeah over time tiktok is a great platform to grow and you know you can use that audience later and move them over to your YouTube channel so now's the best opportunity so take advantage